Bori Ranmaru. From an early age, Ranmaru was an attendant to Oda Nobunaga, recognized for his talent and loyalty. He was appointed to a responsible post at Omi. He was given 500 koku, and after Takeda Katsure's death, he was awarded the 50,000 kokoku at Imarari Castle. Ran Maru and his younger brothers defended Odo Nobunaga during the Hanono Chi incident and allowed him to commit seppuku. Ran Maru and the rest of his retainers ignited the temple in which they had barricaded themselves. The fire killed everyone inside and burned the body of the Oda, therefore preventing his capture. In Nashoku literature of the Edo period, it was commonly depicted that Oda and Mori had a sexual relationship that was commonly found in those times. So, it seems logical that the Lord's lover Ran Maru was the one who helped the Lord commit seppuku. He was the most intimate with the Lord, so yeah. Then also, uh, the other guards and his brothers most likely aided Nyasuke's escape with the Lord's head to get to his son and warn him and not have his head taken uh, alive. Really quick on Ran Maru. Uh, there is some speculation that uh, the Lord, I think it came to the Lord's service at like 13, 14, or 15. So there is some talk about that behind the scenes, uh, whatever. You know, it's a different time or or not. So I'm not sure when exactly this relationship started, but allegedly, yeah, there was a homosexual relationship with the young man and the Lord. Um, yeah. The practice of collecting heads in Japan. Head collecting has a long history in Japan and in its most basic form can be seen as proof of the job well done, proof that the kill or kills have been made. For the most important of heads, those of senior samurai or lords, protocol was strict and always observed if they was time. Of course, in the heat of battle, that was not always possible. In Korea, during the invasions of the 1590s, the samurai led tried their best to collect heads, but the sheer number of kills and the distance to carry them back to Japan, not mention logistical problems, and getting them through a hostile country meant that a nose or ear had to suffice. Nubunaga's head. There is no evidence for Yasuke having taken Nubunaga's head, however Oda family lore has it so. Yasuke's memory does live on in the families that were most closely associated with him. Another story has him associated with a supposed death mask made for Nobunaga, but this is highly unlikely. Nobunaga's legend Oda Nobunaga is one of the most popular figures in Japanese history. Enter any bookshop in Japan or on many street corners and in most train stations of any size and you will find a book about him, either fact or fiction probably both. It's open to question why he enjoys such popularity, but his decisiveness, ruthlessness, and charisma are always cited. 